might scratch another task off our list while we're here, if we are so inclined. When the mind is split, the heart must lead. Or so I We meet again. Truth be told, I was hoping we might. Would you care to stay and talk a moment? I'm glad. Sit down, won't you? I'm rather fond of this place. I never imagined a city could be like this. So full of excitement, so... alive. And how could I have? In all my life, I've hardly left the palace. My mother is quite... strict. You understand. Oft did I long for a taste of normal life. Even aught as simple as going shopping for myself. My mother has always procured the things I covet for me, so to pick out an item and obtain it with my own hands held a certain appeal. Which reminds me, I owe you a debt. I fear I cannot repay the full sum all at once. I have rather little in the way of spending money. Pray, take this for now. You'll have more when next we meet. My apologies, friend. But I'd best be going. I mustn't let Mother find out I left the palace. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope we'll see each other anon. Till then, farewell. Follow me. Gather round, gather round. Treat your ears to a tail bite. These writings could We've come all this way only to find ourselves unawaited. Perhaps our timing was awry. This is the wrong time of day for what we have in mind. Welcome to the Star Trek. We serve all manner of fine ales here. Shall I pour you a cup? Come back any time. Hmm? Welcome to the we serve all manner of fine ales here. Shall I pour you? Come back any time. Here to ask all of me, are you? Greetings, Your Majesty. Have you a moment to speak? much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen you've done a fine job culling those monsters your majesty tis common knowledge among the people that twas you who delivered them from danger the number of those who seek out this tavern in the hope of an audience with the arisen grows by the day should you continue to display such valor the day will soon come when Disa can no longer deny your presence and here, it slips my mind. Pray, take this. Tis a symbol of my own gratitude. We have achieved our objective. Indeed, you've culled more than your fair share of monsters. I expect the tales of your valor will soon be told in taverns. I like that! There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to str you will need to infiltrate the palace to gather evidence of Deezer's misdeeds. I hesitate to ask something so dangerous of you. Yet I fear we have few other options. I have attempted to do the same through my own channels of now. Though, I have yet to uncover so much as a whisper of her plots. Would that I could undertake the task myself, but my station prohibits me from reckless action. What say you, Your Majesty? Might I ask this task of you? I shall ensure that the door to the Queen Regent's office is open between midnight and dawn. Pray use that time to conduct your investigation. I've heard some interesting tidings about town. If you refer to changes in the military's makeup, I've heard the same. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's thrills to gathering items. I am. Where to next, Arisen? I 
Someone is looking this way. Is there aught about me that caught their eye? Ladder, is it? How convenient. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. We could pick some now and use them when the need arises. Uh, do you know how long you'll be? You are the Arisen, yes? The captain gave me your description. Follow me! you move along. Should one of the other guards spy you, I will be forced to play my part.
blessing. Who's there? Pray, keep your voice low. It wouldn't be good for either of us if someone was summoned to come check on me. Could it be that you have come to bring Mother's schemes to light? Aye, Deesa is my mother. Pray forgive me for not telling you sooner. It was never my intent to deceive you. I simply feared that if I spoke the truth, none would wish to involve themselves with me. But that is no longer a concern. It is clear that we are allied in purpose. My word! You mean to say that you are the true Arisen? That the Sovereign currently residing in the palace is a pretender? Could Mother have had a hand in that as well? Regent Kin Sven appears to be missing from his chambers. Have you seen him? Me? No, sir. Then start searching, you fool. Should aught befall the Regent Kin, tis us who'll answer to her grace. Forgive me. My absence seems to have made this rather more difficult for us. You ought leave the palace at once. This room turned up little of interest, but I've a mind to look into this further. I shall send word to Captain Brandt if I discover aught you should know. I'll head out first and speak with the Sentinels. Use that opportunity to make good your escape. Ah, good. You returned. I find myself on edge when you stray from my line of sight. What's this? Come to admire my sculptures, have you? Ho, oh, oh. To think my eminence as a collector would reach in the ears of the Arisen. If only my collection were complete, I'd fain allow you to inspect it. Alas, the sculpture that I commissioned to be its centerpiece is yet to arrive. And would wound my pride to have you behold my collection ere it is made whole. If your curiosity shall not be denied, however, mayhap you consider paying a visit to the sculptor in my stead. The man's home is located in Bak Batal. You need only tell him that I eagerly await the sculptor's completion. What say we gather some information? There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your... How fared your mission? Was there aught suspicious to be found in the Queen Regent's office? This scrap. 
was part of a letter, and from Batal, no less. This alone can prove little, but it is clear that Deez's schemes run deep. To think, Deez's actions have weighed even on the mind of her own son. Tis a surprise, but a welcome one. Deza is a, the doting mother before the Regent King. If Regent King Sven is willing to aid us by drawing Deza's focus, we may be able to gain here more useful information. You have done well, Your Majesty. Though I am limited in the aid I am able to offer, I bid you, take this. It seems we were right to suspect the Queen Regent. We ought to keep an eye on her in the days to come. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to... Of all those who serve the Queen Regent, there is but one who I have no doubt will lend his support to your Majesty's cause. I refer to Waldar, a magistrate. Many a time as Deza demanded Waldor amend the Code of Vermont to her own benefit. And many a time as the magistrate refused her, for he's loyal to none but the spirit of the law. As a result, he now sits in a cell beneath the palace. Our laws dictate that your majesty is our rightful ruler. Thus, as the staunchest supporter of the law known to the palace, I'm quite confident that Waldor will be willing to vouch for your majesty. What say you? Might you be willing to aid me in arranging the magistrate's release? I've prepared a means for you to enter the palace dungeons. Pray, take this. This mission demands the utmost secrecy. Pre should you be discovered, I will be unable to lend aught in the way of aid. No time to catch your breath. Try to keep up. Have no fear, Master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. I suppose all we can do is wait. <laughs> so, you've come. Captain Brandt bade me allow you passage. No 
the sternest of the night. I'm sure I can handle this. You have no right. you please, eh?
Stay away from me. Stay away from me. What's your problem? Don't like this. Yeah. Come to embroil me in your affairs, have you? I'd sooner be left. I wish to read every tome, every... Pray, do not interrupt me. This tome is all I have to me. Come to embroil me in your... Apologies, Master, but you will have to make do without us for the time being.
supplies I can always run. It appears to be locked, and we've no key. Shall we fret not? I'll make the pain go away. Hold. Just a moment. metal. Huh? Thanks, I suppose.
And have you come to release me from this jail? No. Uh -huh. Then we are presented with three options. Either the law of our world that allows only one arisen has been upended, or Deezer's arisen is false, or you are lying to me. Have you proof that you are arisen, as you say? Ah, they say the arisen's breast bears a wound akin to the dragon's claw. By that mark, t'would seem tis true. This reminds me of a happening 148 years ago. During the reign of Regent Alphonse, a man named Crusoe appeared and claimed to be arisen. He went before the people, insisting that he, and not Regent Alphonse, was the true arisen, the one fit to lead them as their ruler. And what befell him? Ha! Crusoe was discovered to be a liar, whereupon his head was liberated from his shoulders on the spot. Aye, I dare say your arrival portends another beheading, but whose will it be, hmm? Escape? But why? Here, I spend my days perusing the code and deciphering old texts. I can devote all my time to my own interests, and I need not turn my ear to Deesa's absurd demand. Tis a paradise to me, this cell. That said, if you know of a place with a mountain of tomes I could delve into, I might rethink the matter. Tell me. That I suspected as much. Then... A place to quench what... Well, I suspected as much. Then... Good to see you, Master. Arms, arms for the poor. Pray grant those less. Some salvation. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. I'd say we collect as much as we can carry. Gazing upon the sea makes me feel rather strange. I see no reason to approach. Best we keep our distance.
this wasn't supposed to happen. You. So this is it. So I'm quaking in my boots. Who wouldn't be? Have courage. I'm right here beside you. Good heavens. Hey, I, I mustn't falter. You have no right. Bad to worse. Stand strong! Whatever I'm at it. <laughs> 